Hey, what's up guys? Mule Skull here. Welcome to Korea. Uh, this game was just released on Steam, finally. Out of early access. Um, congratulations. Version 1.0. Woohoo! So yeah, we're going to be starting a Let's Play today. Um, yeah. We'll get to character creation and stuff like that. I am jumping into this version 1.0 blind. Um, I haven't even checked the change log. I just, um, yeah, who this? Who this guy? That's that's an old file. Um, it says broken right there. So single player, we are going to delete this one. I don't even know what that is. <laughs> uh, new world. Let's name it Muley Land as usual. Uh, the size, I think we're gonna go large. I want a big, large world for this one. Um, default. Continue. Okay, so we're generating the world. Um, yeah. If I remember correctly, this used to take a little bit. <clears throat> um, but yeah, we're going to get this Let's Play going. It's going to be very fun. I love Korea. I love it so much. It's such a fun game. Um... It's a 2D sandbox, and I'm not gonna. I'm gonna try not to drop the T word, because uh, it's nothing like it. <laughs> well, it is in uh, genre, and that's about it. Um, there's a like a uh, like a skill system. There's um, stat like character development. I guess it would be. Um, yeah, it's just, oh, this game's so cool. You guys will like it. I did a, a Let's Look on it, I think, last year. Um, and yeah, I'm, I'm just, oh, I've been waiting for release to start a Let's Play because I wanted to get the full experience here with you guys. Uh, not have to deal with bugs or um, other things that Early Access has, you know, when they're still making the game. But yeah, come on, polish those biomes. Holy moly. But yeah, this game is super sweet. Come on now, simulate the grass. Let's let's do this. Oh, I'm just gonna bring you guys back. Okay, I'm back. Um, yeah, we have this character here. We're gonna delete that one. Uh, we're gonna create a new one, and this is gonna be a new melee. So we are male. Um, kind of hair. Let me see here. Um, that one looks decent. I don't wear glasses. I do, however, have a very, very overgrown beard right now. Uh, probably that color. What about hair? Hair's about that color, but I like to pick something that's not normal. Normal for me, anyway. Uh, let's, let's go with, like, oh man, let's just be an old man. Let's just do it okay old man muley <laughs> uh shirt we're gonna go with uh that that color can i change the type of shirt i have no pants uh that looks there we go and uh what kind of shoes let's oh wait can i have different pants like shorts no shoes okay uh let's go with the Let's go with the white kicks. I think that's pretty cool. Maybe, yeah, we'll go with those ones. That's okay. Uh, this character's name is Muley. The difficulty is going to be normal. And I'm going to create the character. Oh, look at how quick that is. Oh, so much better. And here we are, my friends. Welcome to Korea. Uh, there's so much to explore in the world of Korea, but it has become a hostile place. And you must watch your step. Alternate between build and combat mode by pressing R. Be sure to be in combat mode when you encounter monsters. Skills can be, can be placed on the combat toolbar and a consumable item in the quick item slot, uh, which is Q apparently. Switch to a second combat loadout with tab. Change to building mode to dig, chop, interact, and build. Items can be placed on the toolbar and be quickly used with the right mouse button. Cycle through toolbar items with tab. Let's get started started by defeating some oil slimes and chopping some trees. Okay, this is new. Um, 
this wasn't the tutorial wasn't here uh, last time I played so that's pretty awesome all right let's uh chop some trees Ooh, old zebra tree this is cool so yeah um, I'm super excited to play this we're gonna do it and see you get uh, if you look in the bottom left you can see that I'm getting a uh, points for what I'm doing like uh, there's explorer there's gathering there's combat there's uh, I think it's called sile which is magic um, and yeah it, oh, it's just so cool guys <clears throat> so yeah here we are in our world there's an oil slime off to our left uh, we should go fight that thing get over here punk Cool, I got fireball. Oh, you know what? I don't have ledge grab. That's all right. We'll not worry about him right now then. Um, let's see here. Okay, so I just have regular harvesting. I see this clay here, so I'm kind of getting it. Hey, you. Gotta let it charge. Ready? Bam! Get over here, punk. Bring it. Oh, I can't move with the shield. Ouch! Right in my butt. Oh, block. You get a perfect block. Uh, to if you can get a per, uh, <laughs> if you get a perfect block, it uh, blocks better. But I haven't quite mastered it. Last time I played, I um, what it is is you see it go up and oh, it used to flash. I think I think that's what that little flash is. If you get a perfect block, it helps. Oh, didn't want to do that. Oh, Lanteed! So yeah, um, it's been a while since I played this. But, don't worry my friends, it's it's new to me. I haven't played 1.0. These guys are butts. They usually shoot like machine gun speed pellet things. Yep. And they like... Sometimes they'll reproduce. Um, talents make your character more powerful. Earn talent points by performing related actions. That's what I was showing you on the left side of the screen. For example, you can uh, gain gather TP by mining, chopping trees, and obtaining new materials. Open the talent window by pressing T or clicking the talent button on the right side of the screen. Uh, right over here. Uh, each talent has many skills associated with it. For example, the ledge grab skill. <laughs> Sorry for the spoiler, guys. Uh, is a perfect part, or is a perfect. Where where'd that come from? There isn't even a perfect in there. It's a part. <laughs> is a part of the explore talent. Uh, it is a perfect part, by the way. <laughs> skills can be leveled up using TP. There are only two. There are two types of skills: active and passive. Active skills can be placed on your toolbar and used. Start by leveling sword proficiency under the arms talent, which makes it possible to do a timed two-hit combo with swords. Okay. So, let's hit T. Um, we are going to go to arms. Let's look for sword proficiency. There it is. Let's use some there. And gather. Uh, we want tool proficiency because uh, you can uh, change the area size of yeah that's what that does so yeah we're gonna do that for sure because then uh, when we gather we can hit F and we can mine four at a time which is just uh, so much better it is great <laughs> okay that's good enough um, I need to harvest more wood you can't go wrong harvesting wood in this game Okay, there we go. Uh, we might need a little stone, but I don't want to grab it from there. Ah, I blocked two of them. Yeah, see, that's the little sprouty thing. You want to try and kill these. Uh, before they sprout, you butts. Because then it makes three of them. heal up. Okay, here we go. Bam! I'm, I'm missing the timing on that. Because you can do a two-hit combo if you go one, two, like that. 
But I'm just spamming like hell, and that's not good. Ah, oh, and I didn't block any of that. That's okay. Oh, you get exhausted if you uh run out of stamina too. Good tip. Oh, and this has achievements now too. I'm super excited for that. Um, I kind of browsed through them, but I didn't want to get, like, a spoiler on those either, so... We'll get to them someday. Oh, is this copper? It sure be! We get lots of TP from this early game. Yeah, buddy! Is that music a little loud for you guys? I better check that. Um, let's see. We want to go audio... Music's at 30. Um, I want to bring this down to about 40. This is at about 50. That should be okay. Otherwise, I'll just fix it afterwards, hopefully. Uh, I'm using Shadow Play again, so it's it's good for recording, uh, but it's kind of iffy because uh, I just don't like how the audio comes out. I'm used to having, you know, two streams. I've discussed this, but we're not going to talk about it right now. Uh, let's get some vine, too. Vine's good to have. Okay, so there we go. Um, How are we doing on skills? Explorer, do I have... I don't have any explorer. Dang it! I was hoping to get ledge grab. Craft. Don't have anything there. Gather. We can do tool proficiency again. Um... Yeah, let's do that. Sile, we haven't used enough of this. Uh, that's the fireball and um, all of your moves, your magic basically. It comes from Sile. Uh, that's okay though. Did we level up at all? Let's see, where's the other lower map craft? Talent, equipment, I think it's equipment. But yeah, you have stats. Very, very cool. Okay, um, I don't have ledge grab, so I can't get up there quite yet. I mean, I could, you know, block it up, but... I say we gather and we build a house. I want to build a house today. So, let's chop down some trees. I think we're going to do like a little floating house thing going on here. Because, yeah, the building is pretty sweet in this, guys. I think it's a C button for craft, isn't it? Equipment, talent, inventory, craft, yep. So C, I'm gonna make some lumber. Um, I think we're just gonna craft it manually for now. So you get craft talent for that. And eventually the TP goes down because you've done it a few times, so. Something to keep an eye on. Let's make some paper too. Um, I don't have a surface yet. Okay, I can't make one quite yet. That's okay. I don't think anyway. Let's see. I want to go talent, craft, did I get any expertise? Cool. That's for uh, better quality items. The goal is to get quality as high as possible. Once chaos reaches 100%, you can no longer increase the quality. Uh, every few steps a chaos trigger will occur, which usually c increases chaos. <clears throat> Uh, craft skills are the key to com com uh, combating the chaos and, and increasing quality, but each comes with with a step cost. Higher quality results in higher quality items or more quantity of the crafted item. Uh, it doesn't make sense to you right now, but it will eventually. Um, once this goes to 100, your quality can't go up anymore and that's the item you get. Uh, there's different skills you can get that keep the chaos from going up uh, as fast. Eventually it will reach 100, but um, th the key is to get 50 of 50 quality before the chaos gets to 100. So I hope that helps you guys understand that a little bit. <laughs> oh, I need to craft um, a research desk is what I need to do. So I need some oil cloth and feathers. Feathers are going to be a pain because the birds run away. Trying to hit that two, that two-hit combo, my friends. Do we see any birds? 
Um, I thought I saw one up here. Yep. Okay, there's two up there. Um, what I need to do... Ah, I can't do it. Okay. Is jump! Ah, dang it. That used to work. Inventory. Let's get some dirt. Some dirty dirt in my... Right there. There we go. Number one. Let's go there. Uh, can I place there? Please? Please let me? Okay. Why can't I place? Oh, you are the butt. Punk? Oh! Wasted you. Okay, um... <laughs> not really. <laughs> Let's go like this. Now, why am I not being able to do this? It's not letting me place. Why? Why you no let me place? Come on. Does it need to be... Um, hmm... Let's see, remove is control left click. Let's put it up here. No? Why can't I place the dirt? I want to place the dirt. Dang it. Ugh. That is strange. Um, let's see, I need... Not lumber, I need <clears throat> to craft. Uh, home. I can't do anything there yet. I need a feather. That's all I need. Charge up. There's my feather. Oops, didn't time it right. Here we go. Nope, didn't time it right. Ah, whatever. Okay, um. Let's get this out of the way. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why that's not letting me place. Should! Right click, place item. Ah, uh, must have been just placing it on grass or something. Okay, here we go, we're gonna make the jump. Ugh. There we go. Birdie! Ah, uh, thank you, thank you. Ah, uh, kill this bird too. And a level up. The journey begins achievement unlocked, my friends! Woo! Oh man, so good. Okay, let's make a research desk. Um, what this does is allow you to learn different, uh, well, <laughs> research is the key to learning about new cra new items to craft to start take the research desk from your inventory place it on the ground right click on it to open the research interface researching a material reveals parts of recipes in which uh that material is used so like uh like if we were to research a torch or well if we were to research like wood it would be part of a recipe for a torch um if that was a thing but um, researching a material reveals parts of recipes in which that material is used. Select a category to research recipes in that category. Example, researching bone under weapons reveals parts of the bone sword recipe. Uh, researching consumes materials. Scraps, which are a byproduct of researching, can be used in place of materials. Uh, when you use a material to research things, there's a chance you could lose it. Um, well, you will lose it at the beginning. But there's ways of doing it later on that you don't. I think. I think there's a skill that allows you not to do that, but... Um... Can we use and play? Okay, so, uh, recipe progress can be viewed in the recipes tab. Material research progress can be viewed in the materials tab. Be sure to research new items as you find them, and that's why we need a research table. Okay. So cool. Oh, you wanna fight, punk? Bam! Ouch. Oh, look at that, hitting the two. Um, crafting is a, a crucial, is crucial to survival. A crucial to survival. <laughs> Press C or click the anvil on the right side. Open the screen with crafting and receive. You get it. <laughs> okay, so um, we want to, ooh, a wood club. What do I have on me? I have a wood club. I also have a wood buckler. Okay, um, so let's open the inventory. I did already craft some torches just because I know this, guys. I know it. 
Uh, let's set this right here for now. Now, the reason I want close to this crystal is because this is uh, a waypoint, basically. Um, so yeah, we can we can use way shards which go around them. Uh, there are these little crystal things right here. Let me show you. Little crystal things called way shards. That's what you use to basically fuel your teleport to other crystals in the world. Okay, so I want to interact with this. I want to research bone in weapons. Uh, so now it says I gained 62 for craft talent and I learned part of the bone recipe or bone sword recipe. Um, the other one would be weapon or lumber in the weapons category. Uh, so I learned part of the bone sword recipe. Oh, I researched and learned those in the bottom right. Let's heal up. Boom! Get out of here, punk. Oh, it's awful quiet, isn't it? Um, let's... Uh, what am I doing? I'm hitting... Oh, my, my keys are so messed up. I've been playing a few different games lately. Can I put this into combat? No, it has to be into building. Okay, um... Let's... Can I move that? Here. Here's what I want to do. I want this here. And I want dirt... <clears throat> wherever it went. Um... I guess I don't have any dirt. Oh, I used it. Okay. Um, yeah, it stays in your hotbar. Just so you know. So let's uh, place a torch. Let's place another torch, because it's going to get super dark, guys. Really dark in this game. Uh, not even messing around. Alright. Get some torches down, Muley. That way we can see the things around us. Okay. Um, so now, let's see, I can, <clears throat> I should research vine, uh, cause that's for the, uh, yeah, learned bone sword, learned the, I didn't see it cause the achievement, but, yeah, see we learn things like this, and then, uh, we got some scraps from that, now we lost some of the things in our inventory, but that's alright, now we can research using scraps instead of wood, um, so we're gonna use scraps, Actually, we should save scraps, honestly, because later on some of those things are pretty rare and you don't want to use them. Yeah, see, like bones. We only have one, uh, and I don't want to use it for that. So, uh, we're going to try and work up scraps, researching other things. Way shards are everywhere. Um, I got a few scraps, and now I can go to armor and then bone and use scraps and save my one bone. Uh, learn bone shield. Sweet. Um, let's do lumber. There's plenty of trees in the world. Let's do this one. There's plenty of pretty much everything in the world, but you you gotta research because it gives you crafting XP anyway, uh, and that helps with um, overcoming that chaos when you're trying to build a quality sword or armor. So yeah, that's uh. That's uh, kind of the the basics of crafting for you guys. <laughs> now let's see. Um, I don't have anything for any of these skills yet. I might for arms because I've been kind of kicking butt, taking names. Nope. Explore? I haven't really explored anything. Nope. Okay. So that's cool. Uh, yeah, we got a research desk. Let's see here. Recipes, materials. So yeah, it'll show you... Um, you gotta research things to learn other things or be able to um, research other things. So yeah, you gotta level up. And it's nighttime. What a wonderful night it is too. Now let's see, what can we craft as far as surfaces go? Nothing yet. Uh, weapons, we can make a bone sword if we had one more bone. So I say we go and fight something. Um, I should craft some more torches though. Essentials torch. Let's make as many as I can. Uh, you can forge with chaos, but not. You don't want to do that with torches. Might as well just do. You use chaos for other things. <laughs> okay, so got torches in my hot bar. That's cool. Cool. Place a torch. 
Um, I thought I saw some stuff over here. Yeah, you guys see how dark it is? Ah, there's a bone slime over there. Or, oil slime. Kill this bird. Get his feather. Oh, jeez, that hurt. There we go. Drop a bone. Nope. No luck there. So yeah, um, there was an update to make the world darker. And this is a biome I really don't want to go into right now. Uh, that's... That biome is very mean, guys. <laughs> uh, ooh, we got some pots. Pots have all sorts of cool stuff in them. Torches and... Uh, Ari, which is kind of like a currency, if I remember correctly. Um, oh man, I'm so excited to be playing 1.0. Holy cow. Oh, is that... Can I... Can I mine... I was going to say, is that bone? Can I pick up bone from that? I guess not. But yeah, this biome is not very nice. We're not going to hang out here for very long. Okay, let's go. Ooh, my gather leveled up. Sweet! I don't think sheep drop bones. Oh, jeez. We need a heal heal. I know, I shouldn't kill the sheep. <clears throat> but, they do give me XP. And these are level 2 sheep. So I can't complain about that. Um... However, I do need some sort of block. Ah, there's a piece of dirt. <clears throat> Man, what is up with my voice today? Holy cow. <clears throat> Man, my voice is so dry right now. It has been hot, guys. Holy moly. Yeah. We're gonna get this dirt. Okay, um, dirt, I want you right here. There we go. Now it's placing. <clears throat> oh man, I picked the wrong time to do YouTube. <laughs> oh, I need a drink of this. Hold on one sec. <clears throat> man. Yeah, it's been like close to 100 the last couple days and... I'm not drinking enough water, that's for sure. Um, I need... Let's see, I need a bone. Do I have any bone? I still have the one, but I need one more. Sometimes you can catch these guys on fire. Ouch. Ah, oh, there it is. Sweet! Let's craft a bone sword. Weapons. I could have swore I saw something just jump up here. Hmm. Okay. Um, yeah. Bone sword. We are going to chaos craft it. Are you guys ready for this? Okay. So, we started Zero Chaos, quality 2. What we want to do is use refine. Uh, step cost 1, plus 2 quality. So, we use it. And then we use it again. We use it again. Oh, really? I'm not getting... Well, this is this is just a bone sword, so... <clears throat> um, yeah. So, in a, in six steps, we get plus 25% chaos. But, I think we're going to reach max quality before that. Yep. And that's that. That's weird, though. Okay, anyway. So, we got a very good bone sword, I think. Let's look. Um, 22 power... Yeah, it's just... It's, it's a bone sword. <laughs> Okay, uh, where is character? Let's see, inventory's... That was a weird sound. Open that. Um, oh, we don't have to equip equipment like that anymore? That's cool. I think you used to have to put it on your body. But that was a while ago. Oh, and we leveled up. So, um, I think we're going to go with the... Um, hmm. Let's go the defense route right now. Uh, we'll go one there, and let's go one more on 
Increases critical hit and TP gain chance. Increases chances of finding high quality treasure. Uh, yeah, we'll have luck. I like luck. Cool. Okay, um, so yeah, that's that. <clears throat> what else do we got going on here? Uh, weapons. Oh, hey, let's do our talents real quick. For craft, let's do polish. Um, increases duration by two steps. So uh, each step, it increases plus one quality. Um, and it takes nine to recharge. So it takes nine steps to recharge, I believe. Step cost is three. Yeah, um, it makes sense later on. <laughs> you guys will understand. It's it's pretty difficult to un like to talk about it when it's so far away right now. Um, we are going to. What are we going to do for gather? I guess we're just going to do tool power boost. Um, permanent increases power of all tools by what? Three. Cool. Sile, we're still not close. Arms. Uh, we can learn focus, which is. Uh, Ensures that the next physical attack will be critical. What else do we got here? Uh, sword proficiency, spear proficiency, and bow and shield. I want shield proficiency. Uh, just because it helps uh, f with the shield. Which we're going one-handed right now. So, yeah, that's good. Okay, uh, I want to I wanna build a house. Dang it. Okay, let's uh, go to the research desk. Let's go home. Let's uh, research lumber. I should learn... Oh, door, dresser, nightstand, small table, table, chair. Cool. That's what I wanted. Tools. Lumber. Give me the bone pick. Or pioneer matic. That works. We'll use clay. Um, we'll use dirt. For armor. Yeah, we're just unlocking recipes. More clay. Cool. We'll use the zebra seed, which is those trees I was chopping down. Uh, I want to use scraps for oak seed, because I still want to plant those. Um, so yeah, we're just learning all sorts of armors and weapons and stuff like that. Uh, yeah, we'll just research like this. Research. Novice spear. Vine wand. Uh, yeah, we just learned that, I think. Basics. Vine. Uh, tanning rack and wood box. So we can store stuff. Copper, we're going to use scraps. So we can make a sile chamber. Um, we are going to use lumber. For that one, we're going to use scraps for the wool. More lumber. So we learned how to make cloth, a workstation, platform. My talent level, or my craft talent leveled up. Uh, which is why we just got a ton of recipes unlocked again. Let's, let's do it over again. <laughs> uh, stone arrow, short bow, stone arrow, stone arrow, vine, dirt, lumber. Uh, let's learn this one using scraps. Uh, bronze ingot we just learned. Um, vine, we'll research with a vine. Leather. Uh, more leather, I think. Let's uh, use... We got one torch left. Let's just use it. We'll be fine. Okay, use a hide. So we got the forge, style chamber, leather. Um, let's use scraps because I just used my last torch. So yeah, that's all of our recipes we can do right now. Um, let's take a look at that. Craft. Or no, it's... um. Is it lore? Uh, we'll do lore another time. I don't want to go through it right this instant. Um, filter. No, I want to look at. Uh, gosh, how do you do that again? Equipment inventory. Is it recipes? Could have swore that's what it was. Recipes. Hmm. Hey, we can make oil pudding. Which is a really low way of getting HP, uh, if, if you're the potion type. <laughs> I, I prefer to work on the heal ability, just because you get experience for it and uh, stronger spells later and whatnot. 
But yeah, let's go on a little journey, kill some things. Oh, try out this new sword. So it does eight and nine now, rather than, uh, what was it, four and five or six, something like that. And I didn't even notice all these pots over here. Down here. Oh, man. Getting some oil, oil clots, and Ari, and vines, and feathers, and wool from that dude. Ooh, and is this iron? That can't be iron right now. No way. Uh, what are you dudes? Okay, level one and two. Oh, and a chest? Ah, sweet. Um, I'll take the oil clot. I'll take the Ari. I can't really carry the ectoplasm. What are you? Okay, these are all level ones. I'm not worried about them too much. I want to... Ah, it's not. It's sand, isn't it? Yep. I was going to say, no way. Did I just find iron on the surface like that? You can, but... Uh, it's not super rare or anything, but still, you know. Why can't I place on the back wall? Okay, that works. I just want a way out. I just want to get out. Your butt. There we go. Okay, cool. Um... I want to take this wood box, I guess. Uh, I picked up everything, but... Okay, let's take this mushroom seed. Or, uh, marshmallow seed. Mushroom seed. No such thing, Muley. There we go. I can't go that way. Well, turd bucket. Um... I have a squirrel arrow. I'm gonna throw that away. For now. Um... Yeah, we can pull it out of the trash in a bit. <clears throat> okay. So let's get out of here. I want to get out of this hole. I want to... Thank you all for watching. I hope you're excited about this series. Uh, I am very excited. I'm going to be playing it for a bit. We're going to have a good old time. Uh, it's good to be back in a 2D sandbox. And it's even better it's not Terraria right this instant. I said the T word. I said I wasn't going to do that. Dang it. <laughs> but anyway, guys, I want to thank you all for watching. Uh, give me a like, comment, subscribe. Tell me what you think. Uh, and yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.